Hello everybody, this is my second ever Funko Pop figure. And I swear, I am not becoming a Funko Pop collector. <laughs> I had to get Pickle Rick, one of the Pickle Ricks that they did, because it was important. It was important to my life. I have to get this, or had to get this. I have to have this, because it's Master Chief. Big Halo fan. I have a whole room dedicated to Halo stuff. And I had to get this to put it in that room on display with other relevant memorabilia. Let's check this thing out. Okay, well, this, uh, this looks pretty good at first. Has some, some wash on there. You got, you know, some weathering. The little Cortana, I'll have to look closer at the Cortana. It almost didn't stand out. On this on this completely level surface here it's a little bit heavy towards the back let me see if this will rotate yeah the head will rotate that's good so I can actually put them in a pose that I like a little bit better the the feet are not completely lined up and level I feel like that can be bent a little bit better into shape pretty easily but yeah it does seem to to stay there a little bit better this way the the gold has a lot of flake in it, a fairly large flake. It's not too bad. It's a slightly orangish gold. I appreciate that rather than going with more of a champagne color that would not have been as appropriate. And around the back, a little bit of ghosting from just the the adhesive used there. I think that can be just burnished down. The overall uh, level quality of this thing is actually way better than it was on the pickle rig fig figure that I got. So that's good. Yeah, I'm I'm perfectly satisfied. With this, I like the level of detail on the on the body as well. That's pretty good. Can this actually be angled? No, I think it's just it's just able to spin around. Now uh, I want to see if there's a way that I can get a good look for you at just Cortana. Now you don't seem to be able to rotate her around, so she's always going to be facing in like that. But obviously they've done her in the the pop style as well, which is absolutely appropriate. And uh, I think the body there is just completely clear and they use a little bit of transparent blue coming up from underneath to give a little bit of that hologram sort of effect. Yeah, I can't tell if that's actually a line that's printed on, on her face intentionally or if that's just a, a little bit of a miss or a scratch on there. I, I tend to think it's a scratch on there, but I think the whole thing is actually silver and they use a couple of different colors. Oh, come on, focus, focus, focus for me, focus. Ah, dang it. Uh, I think they used a di couple different colors of blue, possibly, on that. But yeah, that's done pretty well. And here, you know, looking up closer again, you can see how the the detail on the armor is, is handled pretty well for something of this type. You know, just a basic vinyl figure. So again, yes, I am I'm definitely happy with this. Much more happy than I was with my first ever... <laughs> Funko Pop figure and I again I, I am not going to be collecting Funko Pops but I may get more in the future but anyway I just wanted to share that experience of having a look at this thing for the first time upon taking it out of the box I don't know exactly when this was released I didn't look that up it is stamped 2018 for the copyright on the base of the foot but that doesn't mean all that much I just happened upon it on Amazon and was like, you know what? I should have one of those. So now I do. I'll put it on display. And I think I like having it on display. Thanks for watching. I'll uh, catch you later. Promethean attack force mobilizing.
attempts to my work. Please 